let's go. Welcome back. Sunday night. Hope you have a lovely Sunday night. I'm going to pull up a chessboard and play some five minute blitz. Let's go. Robert. What's having a think? Okay, my opponent's just not going to play. Okay, we have a move. Let's go. I'm okay with this pre-moving here. Since my opponent didn't, I'm going to get solid in the center. Let's go. Grabbing here. Sheik. Okay, I'm going to put the bush here. Moving here, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna grab this bishop. Develop my knight here instead of here. That way, there's no sudden attacks. And prepare Ooh. with the pawn here, it's the right time to play this. The bishop can't go this way. Bishop will likely drop back here. Okay, this would be terrible work. Go after the bishop, but this feels a bit offside with the knight. But then how does the knight get back in the game? Forget about that. I'm just going to castle. Time is about even. Still, this isn't an idea I like. Should the knight may land here on f4? Yeah, knight f4. Um, yep. Open up the center. Using arrows, I takes pawn takes. I'm wondering if this pawn gets a little scary here. The ideas of playing e6. Okay, when you can go for mate in one, it's usually not bad. But developing the queen with tempo with a threat. Now I'm threatening to take here, after you defend. If you defend with the pawn, well there's this check. Huh. Well there's definitely some pressure here. One is having, sorry for the squeaky chair. One is having a think. Let's go. Hope you all had a nice weekend. Let's go. Okay, we have a move. Defending this mate. But can I temple the queen now? Temple the queen. Uh, using arrows, though. Queen comes here. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's go. Queen comes here. The knight here take templing the queen a second time. Let's go. This is the way. senses it. There's danger. Okay. Hitting the queen. Queen of my dreams. Picking up a pawn. 
Nice advantage on the clock. Full minute. Let's go. Now, look at this. Either knight. Bishop takes, and then the other one takes. I'm going to start with this one. Is there a difference? <laughs> usually there's a difference in chess. If there's two moves, it's usually two rooks or two knights that can do the same thing. It's a difference. I'm going to go with this. Check. You're moving here. Let's go. Okay. So this... Loose... But on, the knight's got to go somewhere. Where's the knight going? Knight's coming. Knight's going back. Be back here. Let's go. Yeah, I felt like that attack was just kind of a bluff. Bringing the queen here. But it all started with knight f4. Knight f4. Uh, historically has been referred to as knife f4. Same with knight f5 for white pieces. These squares are great for knights. Attacking knights. Okay. Hitting the queen. Queen's drop back you're hitting this knight twice. Let's go. Quote is something like, if you put a knight on f5 or f4, uh, you just plop a knight on f5 and the game practically wins itself. Something like that. Okay, this knight's being a bit pesky. Let's go. You're moving this way. Pesky knight. Okay, enough's enough. Just getting this rook into the game. Just gonna drop a rook on the seventh. And then a second rook on the seventh. Let's go. Queen on the seventh, get a rook on the seventh, and even this second rook, perhaps on the seventh. Very happy to sack the exchange. Let's go. Okay, I'm not welcome here, I can see that. Going after this pawn, let's go. Yep, very wise. Okay, I want to keep the rook defending here. I'm gonna go for this. this. Maybe even this. Right now, the bishop and the rook aren't coordinating because there's a pawn here. You do have to watch this future coordination. Let's go. Yeah, rook's coming here. And. No, that would be terrible. Just this, just this. Yeah, not enough pressure here. Check, I mean, if you got him. Let's go pre-moving here. the queen out of danger first let's go of course bishop can block for that bishop or rook can take 
Uh, hmm. Okay, let's get this work active. 10 seconds. 26 seconds. Yeah. Going after Rook. Check here. Let's go. Check. Um, if you got him. Uh, let's go. Hope you enjoyed that. I'll see you next time. Cheers.